Finding your perfect foundation shade can be really frustrating unless you know a few important secrets. I'm Kristen Arnett, an international makeup artist and healthy beauty expert. I've partnered with Mineral Fusion Cosmetics, a natural, cruelty-free brand of makeup that I absolutely love, to share with you three of my pro secrets on how to get the perfect foundation match every single time. I have Masa here with me, who's a private chef and a mom of two little girls. And I just am curious, what is the hardest part about finding a foundation shade that actually matches your skin tone? All of it. <laughs> you know, it's, I go to the store and I don't know if I'm warm tone or if I'm a cool tone. And, and then even worse than that is trying to find someone who can help me with it. Um, I feel like a lot of people don't understand my shade. Yeah. So it's frustrating. Yeah. It really is. And I can imagine that. And I hear that from women who have more color in their skin, that it's like just a sea of light shades and nothing for them. So I think part of it too is that a lot of people are using an old method for foundation matching, which really isn't helpful. And I'm going to show you some tricks that I've learned over decades of being a makeup artist on how to actually get the right shade of foundation for you. Pro tip number one is to actually use the inside of your your arm to see what undertones show up right above the veins so you're looking for the color that's kind of coming through so this way when you look here you're ignoring any skin discolorations inflammation acne sun damage all the stuff that sort of distracts us on the face so if you're warm toned you're gonna see golden colors coming through from the skin around your veins and you'll notice it particularly when you're more tan if you're cool and you're light skinned, you'll see a lot of like pinkish coming through, almost like a blue tone coming in your veins. And you're probably somebody who gets red instead of gets tan. You might get burned before you actually turn brown. If you have dark skin and cool undertones, you'll notice like a purple color coming through. And of course, if you're olive, it sounds like what it is. So you'll see like a greenish hue. And particularly when you're pale, you might think you look a little green in the face. Ooh. <laughs> and neutral is somewhere in between all of that. Okay, so based on all of that, what undertone do you think you are? I mean, I, I see the olive color, so that would be warm. Yeah, it's a little bit of olive, it's a little bit of warm, so you're somewhere in between the two. Ooh. And we're gonna figure out which one it is. So now let's move on to my pro tips two and three on how to figure out your best foundation shade. And pro tip number two is to, again, use the underside of your arm as the place that you test. Because a lot of people say to use your jaw and your neck as you know where you're gonna stripe foundation. And I just really have to disagree on that because typically there are other shades going on that we need to consider. I mean, your face might be a little lighter if you're wearing sunblock, mm -hmm. then your neck, your chest might be a little darker. So this is the place we're gonna start. Okay, so now I'm gonna have you look in a mirror and hold your arm out and just kind of look at the foundation color that seems to average out the difference between your face, neck, and chest. Like what, or mm. you know, a few. Pick a couple that look like they're about the right area. So I would say this first one right mm -hmm. here, and gosh, maybe this one, the first yeah. two. And I would even pick this one too, mm. and possibly this one. So we're gonna okay. try a few oh, different well. ones, and mm. now we're gonna do it on your, your jawline and really just see what's the right one. This is the first color that you said you liked and it's deep one in the powder formula. So we're just gonna put the stripe right here. Good. One of the other shades you said you liked was olive two from the liquid foundation formula. And so finally, we're gonna put on deep one from the liquid foundation formula and see how all that looks. Now I'm gonna ask you to take a look and see which shade you feel like matches best with your face, neck, and mm. chest. I think definitely this one. Yeah. Yeah. And it's a little and darker than you might have expected, yes. but it's gonna create the most harmony on your yes. face. And it's really important that when you're shade matching your own foundation that you're using light that is natural and flat. Try to avoid shadows or too much fluorescent or yellow light. Okay, so the color that you actually picked was olive two. So you were right about having a little bit of that olive in your skin tone. Okay, so we'll just apply this to the rest of your face now and you're gonna see that this is a really amazing color on you. It feels nice on as well, it feels light. Yeah, it's light, it's a beautiful formula, just natural ingredients. The liquid foundation is so, so lovely, especially if your skin's a little bit parched. 
my skin does feel dry a lot of the time. Mm -hmm. So I like this feel of a liquid foundation. It feels moisturizing. Yeah, absolutely. And this has some really nice active botanicals in it that help mm. with that. Plus it's got antioxidants that just continue to help protect your skin. Does the color match? Oh my gosh. Wow. It's lovely. Yeah. It's a it perfect really shade for you. It's almost like I don't even have foundation. And that's exactly what it should look like. It should look like you yeah. in your skin, yeah. not like you've got a bunch of makeup wow. on. That's nice. Awesome. So do you think you can do this now? when you go to the store and you know how to test yourself, yes. find your undertones. But anyways, you've got Olive too. Yes. Be sure to click the down arrow so you can see in the description where to find all the Mineral Fusion foundation formulas and shades, plus a recap of these tips. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and look for the red subscribe button so that you can be notified whenever we come out with more pro beauty tips. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out the rest of this channel for more professional makeup tips and tricks. I'm Kristen Arnett wishing you vibrant health and beauty.